Hey everybody, it's Busy Little Bee. Welcome back to my channel. I fell down a rabbit hole this weekend. My husband and I found dumpster diver TikTok. And these people go to stores and they find all kinds of free stuff that is still in quality condition. So I wanted to share some of this with you guys. So let's take a look. All right, guys, here we go. Oh, it's open again. Let's go. Let's go. They actually left it open. Oh my God. What kind of good luck is this? <gasps> Joe! Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Look at that. Oh my God. Guys, a bunch of iPhone 12s inside the dumpster. Oh my God, an iPad, another iPhone 12. What is this thing? Apple, Nike. Oh my God, guys, we cashed out. Let's go. All right, guys, let's just close this door up. Like how it was. And now we're gonna put this box inside the car, guys. We actually just got the biggest jackpot ever. Oh my God. Let's go. Yo, jackpot secured. Let's go. Oh my God, I'm so happy. All right, guys, now it's time to go home. And once we're home, we're gonna start looking inside the box. All right, guys, we made it home. And look at this jackpot we got. This is actually insane. I'm pretty sure these are iPhone 12 boxes. Maybe iPhone 13, I'm not too sure. Like, look over here, guys. It should say it in the back somewhere. Wait, what? The stickers are gone. There's usually a sticker here that says if it's like an iPhone 12 or 13. But, I'm guessing it's iPhone 12. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Because the iPhone 13 one, I'm pretty sure looks different. I don't know. Is it? This is an iPhone 12. Maybe this is an iPhone 13, is it? I don't know, guys. Comment down below if these are iPhone 13 boxes or not. But anyways... Let's look in the box and see what we got. Okay, these boxes are weird. You know what? Let's look at this first. This is a Nike Apple something. Nike iPod. What? Hold up. Nike iPod? How does this open? Okay, so after we figure out how to open this up. Hold up a second. How does this open? From here? Okay, guys. I literally have no clue how to open this. Maybe from here? Yeah, is it? Hello? Oh my god. Okay. I opened it. Here we go. Let's see what this is. It says Nike iPod. Huh? This is an iPod? What is this? Fits in your Nike shoe? Guys, I'm so confused what this is. Bro, get over here. What? What did you get? I got brand new freaking iPhones. No brand new freaking iPhone way. Check it out. There's another one right there. Google Pixel 4A. These are brand freaking. That's crazy, new. dude. All thrown away in the dumpster? They're like a thousand bucks a piece. There's so much stuff here. Look at all these Holy bags. Go, dude. Stuff. Come with me to Dumpster Dive at the mall. This first stop is Saks Fifth Avenue. And I don't know if you see that, but that's a Michael Kors suitcase. So, of course, I was so excited and I pulled it out and look what they did to it. They slashed all of the leather, like literally everywhere. And they even cut the handles. I was so sad. But the next stop is Victoria's Secret and I had better luck here. So they threw a big bag full of body scrubs away and they're all still sealed. They didn't open them. They just dumped a bunch of lotion and oil on them, but I was able to save them. So I took the bag home with me and I cleaned everything up. I did find out a few of the body scrubs were leaking, but I cleaned them up. And as you can see, they're all new and they all look full. And finally, the last stop is Bath & Body Works, and I got pretty lucky here tonight. I found a bunch of candles and some wallflowers and the wallflower plugins and more candles. They're new in the bag. But as you can see, I found a bunch of candles. Some are new and some are used and then some wallflowers. But don't forget to check out my website and shop my finds, GlamourDDive.com. I know for a fact that that dumpster over there is full of food. So we're gonna do a thunder run, go over there and make sure it doesn't go to waste. The doors are actually open here because they're loading up trucks. So I'm trying to be quick. I'm not worried about what I'm doing is wrong or illegal. I'm more worried about them seeing me and then locking the dumpster up because people are in it. Because some people are like, that's my trash. You can't have my trash. That belongs in the landfill, man. Get out of here. Which, if you were throwing away like sensitive documents, maybe, quick, but quick, quick. if it's food that can feed people, then you're definitely in the wrong, so. All right, let's see what we got in these mystery boxes. Oh, Snyder's, July 8th, 2023. This is old stock that didn't sell at some store, and it gets sent back to the food distribution warehouse uh, for them to dispose of it when it could be donated. When it comes to like recalls and stuff, it's really kiss, keep it simple, stupid. If it just expired, that's why they're throwing it out. Ooh, 
Got lots of chips in here. What are these? These are uh, soft molasses cookies. Let's do some some testing. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's processed to high heaven, so it's gonna last forever. We'll see if it's gonna rain. That'll determine whether I put it out or not. GameStop dumpster diving. Hey, what are you doing? Diving. Dumpster diving? Yes, Get out the stir. Yes. What the heck is... That's a PS5! It was got a PS5! It's got a PS5! Oh my god! Yo, they just threw up a PS5! And they sick us all! There's no fucking way that's real. Wait, is that real? Hold on, it says it... There's no fucking way that that's real. Guys, how do I find out if this is real or not? There's no way that it's real. Hold on, let's look for the tag on the inside. Hold on, hold on. I don't think it's real. There's no way it's real. It would have a tag on the inside if it was real, right? But that's still so cute. Is this real? I don't, I don't think it's real, but I don't know. This is why Apple is the most horrible company in the world. Instead of donating this type of stuff, they throw it away. They just threw away this Apple Store. I mean, maybe the Apple Store computer? I don't know. Maybe display one. Either way, they threw away a bunch of other stuff like cases. So I'm dumpster diving at Nike again. And this big bag looks like it's filled with a bunch of clothing. Everything still has tags on it. This is insane. I'm going to see what all is in here. And I'll show you guys. Okay, I took the bag with me and it is so full of Nike stuff. There are three of these men's jackets, a pink hoodie. Just found another one of those men's jackets. This is a pair of men's pants, a couple of sports bras. There's a couple of hoodies, that one and then that one. Some long sleeves, that one and that one. The last thing is this men's jacket and then a couple pairs of socks. Come with me to go dumpster diving at the Nike store. So I ripped this bag open and there's a ton of clothing and there's also a shoe in here. It doesn't look like they really destroyed anything. I don't see any slashes or cuts. Everything still has tags on. I pulled the bag out and right below it, there's a pair of shoes and then the matching shoe to the one that was in the bag. Here's a quick overview of what I found from Nike last night, the shoes, and then all the clothing. Things look pretty new. So the first pair of shoes, they might be like a return. They look a little bit worn on the bottom. And then these ones look new. They just have a small cut. And then there's a gray Nike tag, $120. And then a pair of shorts. Here's a pair of men's sweatpants. And then a couple of these kids' shirts. A kid's jacket, some leggings, and then there's a couple pairs of these gray athletic shirts, I think for men, more shirts, and a pair of shorts. Lastly, there's a mini backpack, a pair of socks, and a headband. I'm dumpster diving at Macy's and I found this bag here full of like Dior boxes and coach boxes, but it looks like there's actually some good stuff in here, so I'm gonna grab it. Okay, I'm so excited to go through this bag. So it has a bunch of boxes. I can feel some of them are empty but some are not so this first box is full of a bunch of makeup so far i'm finding so much in here these are all in the box i just pulled everything out of its box so you guys can see this was all still in the boxes a bunch of skincare and makeup this is the tom ford lip blush and it doesn't even look swatched all of this came from the dumpster at my mall and it's from macy's